270. Go for it, Tony. Oh! AR500 Armor sent three of these plates to me. They're chest plates and they're part of a body armor system. These level three plates are rated to stop up to about a 308 round at about 2800 feet per second. Today we're going to greatly exceed the rating of the plate shooting it with two different 270 Winchester rounds. This particular round has a bronze tip on it, 130 grain bullet and is rated for 3250 feet per second. And to put that into perspective, that's a heavier bullet traveling about a thousand feet per second faster than a bullet fired out of an AK-47. The second round we'll shoot will, is slightly lighter at 110 grain, but travels at 3400 feet per second. And I stress again, both of these rounds are well above the rating of a level three armor plate. It might be above the the rating That's of the plate. Yeah. Know. Go for it, Tony. Oh! I got one right through. We definitely thought something was up when we saw a lot of uh, dust coming out of the back of the plate. It should be noted that 270 Winchester rounds, such as this, are not considered by the ATF to be armor piercing rounds. And the irony is the ATF has banned a lot of import military surplus ammo they consider to be armor piercing that this plate will easily stop every time. The entrance. Entrance there. I didn't know that 270 had that much power with a bronze tip. It, uh, and then the bullet went a good inch into the cement block there. Oh! oh the I got one went through it. Maybe not. Down into the cement. Okay, ballistic tip oh, 270. 110 grand. 110 grand. Look at the size of that thing. It's mm -hmm. as big as Tony's finger. Touch it. <laughs> <laughs> Whew! That might have gone through too. Now this round did not pierce the plate. I did contact Tyler from AR500 Armor to tell him that we had pierced the plate with the bronze tip round. I wasn't sure if he wanted me to post that or not, but he said go ahead and do it. Uh, they want to show people what the plates can do and what they can't do. And he just wanted us to remind people that we use rounds that greatly exceed the rating of this plate. See, the ballistic tip came apart. Got bronze tip holding together. <laughs> AR-500 armor has been very pleasant to work with. They never told us what to shoot these plates with never gave us any timelines when we had to post videos. And it's nice to see a company willing to show what its product limitations really are.